Hello everybody and welcome back to plugins, reviews, tutorials and showcases. Today we are doing a showcase on floating text plugin called Texter. Um, it's it's uh, helpful and it creates these professional floating texts where you can put around your world. Like this one over here. Looks like this and yeah you can make them nice and easily with um, a few simple commands. So let's let's get into it. Right, so you're going to want to obviously find the place where you want to put one. Let's say we just want to put one here, for example. And then the prefix for these commands is slash txt. So if we do txt, you can see there's A for add, E for edit, M for move, R for remove, and L for list. So simple commands there. So these all, all, all got a very nice GUI as well in here, a UI. So you can put in the floating text name. Now for this one, this is a unique um, tag kind of that you're going to use to identify it. So you're going to want to call it something relevant to where it's going to go. So let's just call it welcome. And then we can put whatever we want in here. Uh, so alt code for colors is 0167 and that puts the symbol then you can put whatever things you want in front of there so let's just say welcome so that's going to be the main title and then you can put the text in here and insert a hashtag if you want to break the line so let's just have a good time then I'll just show you the hashtag does have a good time have fun let's just not caps lock So then, you, once you've done all that, click submit, and there it is. You can see it does an extra line, so put a hashtag, and it looks like this. So it's got the unique name down here, the title, and then the main text you put in. So other commands to edit it, so that's slash txt edit. That will bring up the floating text name, you put that in there, and then you can either edit the title or the text so and then you can edit that there really simple and then there's the move command now this one if you just do slash 60 move you put in the name here so welcome and then that will be moved to your position now you notice this hasn't moved that's because you need it to restart in order to move so once the server is restarted plugins have reloaded that will then be where you put it before so it has worked you just got to restart the server basically don't forget that uh, removing um, is simple slash xd remove and you just put the name in there and remove it and then there's list which is quite cool I like it so it shows you the floating text within 10 blocks from you so then you can click on here and you can edit move and remove it from this menu as well so if you want to shortcut that then you know it will just automatically put the name in that so yeah simple and really good so yeah I'd recommend it it looks uh, professional you know if you have it over here floating text is, always looks professional um, now you might be a bit annoyed about this like name thing down here you can't get rid of that that's not a feature that you can uh, get rid of in the config wish it was though that would be great um, so an alternative if you don't want to use this plugin because you don't like the little name down here you could always use slapper which is the plugin uh, I'll be doing tutorial for next and find an invisible skin and then write uh, the name as um, what it is here and you can adjust the height and everything so if you want it to look more professional uh, but it will have a little shadow down there like you do with a player then that's an alternative which I'll show you in the next episode uh, when we do a slapper so I hope you enjoyed this is obviously quite a simple one um, download to this uh, the pocket download and the github link is in the description uh, as well as required plugins there is none for this you just need to have your server so you need for this 
Um, so yeah, let's just quickly have a look at the permissions. So this plugin is called Texter, if you don't know. So these are the permissions, uh, the command, and then the op kind of asterisk stars. So yeah, nice and simple, nice and easy. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you click the like button. And if you have any suggestions for plugins in the future that you want to see, a review or tutorial for, then let me know in the comments. I know there's a Bed Wars plugin and stuff, I will, I will get around to that, but I've got a few more in ideas to do first. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you want to get your own Minecraft server like this, then link's in the description to mc.shockbyte.com, my affiliate link. If you want to get one, they're really cheap and high quality. That is in the description under important info section. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.